Yeah, hello there from beautiful Port Angeles. We are on the trestle here to the Olympic Discovery Trail. They are going to be hosting a marathon this weekend, and I have come to champion an amazing local lady, a participant. And if anybody deserves to kick back and take the weekend off, it would be Dana. She has a lot of real life excuses, but as you'll see, she makes none. So I uh, am a marine biologist by training, but I think that after I've been around the block for 48 years now, I really think of myself as a survivor, a survivor of a lot of different types of trauma. I'm a survivor of cancer, a survivor of having my leg amputated, so I'm an amputee. I am also a survivor of domestic abuse. And I think we can all say now that if we're still here that we're survivors of the pandemic because I think that that has been very traumatic in one way, shape or form for everyone. The last year has been so hard for so many people for so many reasons. How are you able to be so tough? Well, way back when, when I was just a wee little tot in my 20s, I came up with an idea of running a marathon, and this was long before I ever was diagnosed with cancer. What just started off initially as sort of a personal quest to do this marathon. Eventually, um, my mom was diagnosed with pancreatic cancer, and so she said that she wanted to join me in doing a marathon, and then eventually my mom uh, passed away from her type of cancer, and I made a promise to her on her deathbed that I would carry us both across the finish line. So Stella's actually helping you get your groove back. Yes. I just had this, you know, kind of um, unfinished business. There have been times where I've been gravely disappointed when I needed to stop wearing my prosthesis in 2017 because my cancer in my hip and pelvis prevents me from wearing one. I thought for sure that was the end of the marathon journey and really what ended up happening as I was able to heal and I found these awesome crutches and what started off originally as a personal quest for me has now evolved into a purposeful mission to all of the different survivors, cancer, amputees, survivors of domestic abuse. Symbolism, you say your mom's a butterfly now and we're suddenly surrounded by them. Yeah, she's like, girl, we're gonna do this marathon.